Good morning everybody, happy half term, it's fun day today. I am sat at the office desk because I'm having a bit of trouble getting my weekly vlog out. I think Storm Brian has been playing around with my internet, very slow. I mean it's slow anyway but it, this is just extremely slow. I'm on 72% so hopefully this will get done. It's like 10 to 9 before we head off because we're going on holiday today. I'm not gonna lie, I had maybe a few too many glasses of wine last night and have woken up feeling a little bit rough. I've taken some paracetamol. I'm just waiting for Graham to get back with some ibuprofen. I feel okay, but you know when you just don't feel 100% and I'm like, oh God, why did I do it to myself? My, um, my favorite, Barefoot Zinfandel wine is just so easy to drink. It's bad, like it's bad. And a lot of the time on a Sunday, I would actually just have one glass or no glasses because it's the school run the next day. But because obviously I was like kind of in holiday mode, as you do, okay. but I just, yeah, just was just lapping it up like it was juice. Yeah, bye. Hi, are you taking baby Annabelle with you? Um, um. Eileen's already dressed. I've just got out of the shower, actually. Is it okay if I put my bag in the suitcase because there's a hole? Yeah, but it's because there's a hole there, a space, because I'm putting more stuff in. Good morning again, everybody. Feeling a bit better. I'm still a little bit like, I don't know, not my 100% self but I've just had to crack on, get everything sorted. We are on our way. Oh, I didn't realize you bought baby Annabelle. I, I mean, I kind of secretly knew she was probably gonna come, but I didn't actually I know didn't she Ted. got in the car. I didn't bring Ted. <gasps> Did you not want Ted? Oh. To get some euros because we don't have any money. We didn't plan that ahead. But I have been so organized though. I've literally got all our paperwork. I've got it all labeled and filed and um, we've, we've, this is our check-in, so we've already checked in pretty much, and for returning as well. We've got our car, because we're hiring a car, so we've got our car registration, we've got the insurance, um, and I've got the hotel that we're staying at. So we are working our way into Bristol, the city centre, trying to find our car park that I've set the sat nav to. We're flying from Bristol, but because our flight isn't till about half past four, um, we thought we'd have a look around Bristol to start with because we've actually never been here, have we? And it's just past Bath. So, um, yeah, we're going to get some lunch. The kids are getting a bit antsy. We're there, yeah. Yeah, we're near there. We've found a cheeky little car park, haven't we? Huh? Did you? Yeah, bye. Oh, it's got baby Annabelle. We're gonna get some lunch. Yeah? They're not um, Bristol Cathedral. I feel a bit wrong kind of filming in here, but it is beautiful. Look at that stained glass. Look how beautiful this place is. We've um, already had lunch. We went to a place called Woods Cafe, which was quite cute. We had soup and carrot cake. Oh. <laughs> At the beautiful cathedral. Hi. I'm so excited. Where are we going now? Let's find the airport details. Here we go. On our way. Oh. Made it, departures. Got security checks to go through. We picked up our rental. The flight was really speedy. It was like, it's like 50 minutes or something. Wasn't it? The flight, really, really speedy. It was pretty knackered though. And we've just got to the hotel. It's got free parking, which is handy. Why is that oh, it's a black oh, it does, oh, it must be the sewers down there. Whew. 
Where we're staying, Westcourt Hotel. We've got a bit of a dilemma with our room, as you can see. We've got a double and we've got one single. But there's four people. It's fine. It's because. Where are you going to sleep then? Daddy and Mummy sleep in that bed. And I sleep in that bed as the. Don't worry, I'll look after the house. Is that. As the sleep's on the chair. You sleep on the chair? Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Good morning. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Whoa. I think we all slept like a log. Oh no, it was really hot. Did you find it really hot? Yeah. I found it very, very hot. I just did a duvet off. Yeah, we literally, last night, all right, bye, whoa. Went for something to eat and then went back up here straight to bed. We were just so tired, so hungry, so tired. Stuffed our faces, literally, and then came to bed. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not sh I think there's 100 and um, there's definitely 100 and something. I'm on page. We probably should have bought two box books with you. 50 things to do in Georgia. Cool. What are we going to do then? Breakfast. Do some dough. Wobbly do. Are we going to go walk around, Vi? Yeah. Really go do some sightseeing. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put a little bit of makeup on, only a little bit though because I'm going to wear my glasses today, I really need to give my eyes a rest, I haven't given them a rest for ages, I just keep wearing my contact lenses, so I think I'm going to stick with glasses today, sort Pee myself out, I can see you, <laughs> we found St Peter's Church, beautiful, it's like two seconds away from our hotel, I saw the sign and it changed our lives, yay! Yeah. <laughs> what is this place? What is this place? We're gonna go find the Mill Mount Museum. <sighs> Where's Rohada? City Centre? Getting there. I know. Cute, aren't they? Made it. We couldn't do much of the Mill Mount Museum or tower because they've got um, some kids in for a school play so we're going to come back tomorrow for a proper tour and to go inside the tower. So yeah, they gave us a free look around though which is good. Um, but now we're going to find something else to do. We are back in the car or just in the car generally. Kids okay? We're going to find something fun for the kids today. We're going to a place called Fantasia, is which good? is like an indoor uh, amusement park, I think. We have come to fun indoor amusements. We've come to a place called Betty's Town, and this is called Fanta Fantasia. Bye. Where are you going on? There's just loads of like kiddies things. Money wasting machines, but it's something to do with the kids. So. This is cool. Wow, you're like in a big bus, guy. Moving. Oh. Is it even turned on? Coming the week before half term means that nothing's really open, is it? Quiet. <laughs> yeah, some of the stuff just isn't isn't on. There's loads of stuff. They've got these bumper cars as well, but nobody's around. Right, we're at Betty's Town Beach. Would you recommend Fantasia? Um, yeah. Great for a point. There's one site. You don't spend Good. much money because there's nothing to spend it on. Yeah, because most of it's turned off. Yeah, definitely don't go there when it's um. Yeah, I don't know. When, yeah, probably when it's half turns in summer times, it's probably better. But it just there's nothing really on. The kids liked it anyway, didn't they? We haven't stayed there long. But yeah, now we're on the beach. Very really nice. You could park on the beach over there. We didn't realise. So it turned up to see us. All the storms, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Really covered it up. It's all muddy looking. This one looks nice. Hmm. 
get some coffee <laughs> come to a little bistro place called what's it called oh yeah backwards wow. over there <laughs> i was trying to read it backwards bye Bet oh, betty's town huh? bye betty's town yeah bye oh, betty's town all like two shops that are still open <laughs> there. So i got my cake to take away because they forgot to bring it out <laughs> I ordered a lemon drizzle. Ta -da! No, wow, that is a yummy seven, looking nine. lemon drizzle. But I've come to Southgate Shopping Centre. We're here because we literally drove past it on the way and we were like, oh well, if it starts raining, there's something to do. But I don't know what sort of stores they have in here, but we're going to have a look around anyway. All I can see is a done so far. <laughs> Amazing. Wow, getting one thing we need is toothbrushes for the children. Reminds me of a Marks and Spencer. I'm sorry if it is a Marks and Spencer, but I didn't realise. Back to the hotel to relax. We have decided to, well, Graham's going to book tickets because the cinema is literally two minutes walk from the hotel. So we're going to watch, what are we going to watch, Vi? Try your What are we going to watch? I don't know. Lego Ninjago. Um, it's on in about an hour-ish, so we're going to do that for this evening and then go up for dinner after. Cinema. Hey. I think we've done too early. <laughs> no, it's not. It's just right. It's just nice and quiet. Good film, bye. I had that swivel and then I had to take. We are looking to find the pizzeria that we found earlier when we drove past. See if we can find it. Please travel past. Just over there. Pizzeria. Where is it? Oh my god, it's so tiny, Violet. But yes, it's very, very neat. Should we have a look at your pizza? You're going to eat some more. You just get some tap water. Having breakfast. We're just discussing bread and how lovely and huge it is. <laughs> Look same. at that slice. Is that not a huge slice of bread? Mummy having the same as us. Mm. Mm. While it's having cereal, and um, we are waiting on our breakfast. All right, back in the room. Time to finish off the face. God, that sounds a bit noisy. Wait for that. What that is? Ooh. So bloated, I've had a full breakfast this morning. There's a small child under there. It's not a child. Here's a small child. It's baby Annabelle. We're gonna sort ourselves out and then we're gonna head to Dublin today. Obviously we flew into Dublin, came here. But yeah, we're gonna go to Dublin for the Phoenix Park. We're gonna go to Dublin Zoo. We're gonna have a look round and just do a bit of sightseeing really today. It's supposed to be a really nice day. Looks pretty good. That sky. That's disgusting. Graham Witch. And then let's go. That he's going without us. Phoenix Park. We're at one end of it. <laughs> yeah, it drives three miles apparently to get to the other end of Phoenix Park. It's huge. They did say there's like deer, it is literally like the new forest inside the city. Violet's just tired. Late night and early wake up calls from this one. That's taking its toll, I think. Bless her. She loves her sleep, you know what she's like. Right, it's hitching a ride. Wild, wild lights. It's got all these displays going around. Right, where are we going to go? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna stretch. Hey. Yay! Wow. wow. You're the king of the castle. Beautiful. I got that. I got that. It's not there. I'm gonna go see the monkeys. Come by. Wow, snow leopard. Mm. Snow leopard. I have. Yes. Little monkey. No. There's loads of little babies hidden somewhere in there. 
cool play contraction. Go see some flamingos. Ooh, we're like in a proper cage. Where are they? All right, wow. Let's go. Beautiful. They're actually a real flamingo, Daddy. Yeah. Pumpkins out there as well. It's playing in this little, little, you'd say toddler, more of a toddler. Actually, toddlers wouldn't be able to use this that well. It's kind of a small play area. It's very cute. Where else have we got to go, darling? Yeah, so we've still got to go on that way. Still got loads to do them. I'm going to start walking down. It looks Got a bit darker now. Yeah, so wet darker, body. Everything is a little bit damp. Come on, children. I do it. I do it. <gasps> Violet. Why do they lock you up? Snake. Look at his huge body. Huh? Is there? Oh, <laughs> he, he just jumped at me. Are you oh, Big crocodile. Real one. It's pretty huge, isn't it? Massive. It's actually knackered. They've got like a mini farm as well. With a few animals. And they've got Stan. They've got Stan. Chat. Transformers Rex. Cool dragon. See the dragon? Very cool. Where did you find the monster? We have had some lunch in the meerkat place. You basically eat lunch with the meerkats, so it's pretty cool. Um, we're actually going to find somewhere we can get leap cards and then go into Dublin city centre. We're on a bus. We're on a bus. Violet, have you been on a bus before? I have. Nope. Yes, I have. First time. I've I been have. on a bus. Have you? Yeah. I've been on the bus before. What, with school? Yes, yeah, school buses. Yeah. I've been at all We've never been on it. We've never, as a family, been on a bus before. So this yeah. is a first for everything. Yeah? It's exciting. I have been. We're right at the top, right at the front. And we're heading to Dublin. We made it into Dublin. It is rather busy, but we are looking for the National History, History Museum. <laughs> Shop Central, there's shops absolutely everywhere. I'm like, oh, I want to go shopping. Like, so many museums everywhere. Well, it's tired as you can see. Made it, made it, made it. In a um, souvenir shop, Carol's. What's that? Bookmark. Nice. Who's that for then? Oh. I had one of these as a kid. I remember it so well. It's a soft leprechaun inside. It, it looks slightly different. What's inside? A little soft toy. It's a lucky leprechaun. I had one of those. Right, we have come to the wax museum. We passed it on the way in, so we thought we'd give it a go. I hate mirror mazes. Ugh. Ugh. I don't like it. I don't like it. James Bond. Oh look, boy George. That's pretty cool. Jedward. Of course they were going to be. Yeah. Fuck you too. Look at the Ted. Go on then. <laughs> Harry Potter. Hello. With a beard. <laughs> we saw for the Christmas movie. I yeah, know, he's alive, isn't he? Playing in the seat. Mm -hmm. hotel. <laughs> oh my god. Freddy Krueger. 
I do not like this. <laughs> what? This is going to give us all nightmares, I think. I don't do the horror hotel. That's scary. Was it scary, Vi? It was for you, wasn't it? It was so scary. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know what it is. I'm just, I'm just a wimp now. I am. Oh, it's a scary looking baby. Oh my god. I said, put the poo head on. Oh no, daddy. Your favourite animal. Sprinted. Meltdown. Come on, quick! We're going through Phoenix up. Park now. Graham's eating some donuts. What are they called? Cognuts. Um. Boomerang, you'll keep coming back. <laughs> Boomerang donuts. Let's have a look. Oh my god, Violet got the Malteser. Graham got the Freya Rush in. Alistair got the Oreo. We haven't eaten enough rubbish in our, on our holiday so far. Just chopping it off, you know. Yum. Right, back in the hotel. <laughs> Graham! Yeah, I must have eaten. Look at the reflections on your light. Um, we went out for dinner and we basically came out of Phoenix Park and it was just mayhem with traffic. So obviously it's work when people finish work time. So we just went over the road and just found a nice pub to go to and had, had dinner. I'm so tired. I had one of these when I was a little girl. No, it wasn't in a money box though. It was kind of like in the same tin but it had a different sort of top. Um, yeah. You have to make a wish. It says... Inside is a leprechaun of your own, captured an island while wandering there alone. He has lots of secrets, we are told. So open the can and say, how do you do? Make a big wish and it might come true, okay? How's your Make a wish and then you need to pop him open. Um, don't kill <laughs> Lucky leprechaun. Good morning, last day. We're going home today. <laughs> right, you turn these lights off somehow. Yeah, so we're actually going out for McDonald's breakfast this morning because we thought, why not? And then also I'm going to go to Penny's, which is the original Primark. Primark originates in Ireland. No one knew that. But yeah, so I'm going to go stay down the road. I need to go there. I haven't been to Primark in a long time anyway, so. Oh. <laughs> um. It's not quite got the spark this morning. <laughs> it's a bit dizzily. Right, we are back. Woo. We had McDonald's breakfast and we went to Penny's. It was so busy though, wasn't it? Penny's. Yeah, like it was extremely busy. Um, yeah, I just need to, I think I just I need to go on my own. No family, no kids having to watch. Just felt a little bit unfresher, so. I did get one thing for myself. I got um, this top which was only five euro, which I thought was quite nice. It's got like pink sleeves. Um, I think I'm probably going to wear it for Violet's birthday tomorrow. What are they on the back? Right, heading to the car. We have checked yeah. out and we are yeah. headed yeah. off for, or well, the lady gave us a little tip about going somewhere before we go drop off this car because we've got a little bit of time haven't we mm -hmm. and we don't want to be hanging out in the airport for like four hours so we're going to go to Malahide Castle in through the toll again spend a small fortune on the toll couldn't you Ireland has worn them out <laughs> It's a pretty house. Can we go inside or is it? Let's see what's going on. There's the beautiful castle. I think there's a play over there. Cafe over here. I might even get myself a coffee because I haven't had one today. 
<laughs> She's a wind bag. Windy bag over there. Oh, she's tired. Keep, I keep blaming on tiredness. She's just windy bag. <laughs> you got a little leprechaun set on the top. Come by. Hmm? Oh, 45. 45. 45 what? Years old. How old? Oh, I said 42. And then they cut his head off. <gasps> Christmassy. Reminds me of a um, National Trust. Get these cakes. Insane. Cakes, 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 cakes. Cheesecake. We found the park. Park? Look how big that slide is and how high it is. Alice is over here. Those climbing skills with her feet on the ground. Okay, you did it, Mum. My shoe just dropped. Getting on flight, home sweet home. See ya. <laughs> such a long journey back, oh my god. Well, Graham anyway, Graham's drive. I'm just hungry. Yeah, he's just starving as always. He's like, oh, we're gonna have dinner. I'm like, I'm not even hungry. We actually stopped off in Tesco to get Friday a birthday cake for tomorrow. Um, she spotted a princess one in Asda a few weeks ago, and we were near Tesco, and I was like, I'm hoping there's gonna be a princess one. Um, so yeah, it had a tiara, that one, the one in Asda. Exactly the same, pretty much. It's just, I think this one's bigger for the same amount of money. This is £10. Um, yeah, and the, I like the fact that it's got a pink layer. Excited for tomorrow. You excited? Yes? Look, it's got a crown. I know, we have seen your princess and cake. And it's got... Fittingly, though, my weekly vlog that I said that was uploading while I was away, I've come back to have a look at it, and it says it's been aborted which I've never actually seen that before. So I don't know what happened. Maybe the internet went down or something, but um, sadly it's at 1%. So yeah, I don't know when it's gonna be up. I'm hoping it will just sort itself out overnight and hopefully I can publish it tomorrow sometime. I don't know when, but it's Mommy, so frustrating. Mummy, so, you can't have a shift tomorrow. A shift? Yeah. What do you mean? Because we're going to... Working? Yeah. I'm working tomorrow. You come on. Why? So where, where, where am I going tomorrow? I don't know. Where are you going tomorrow? I don't know. I don't want to go step on step. It's your birthday party tomorrow, isn't it? Yeah, but you have to drop me off. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, so Violet's birthday. This is awkward because... I just don't have enough holiday with work and this is how I've planned her birthday. So I am working tomorrow, it's a Friday, but I'm having her, her birthday party is 11.30 till 2 and I'm working 3 till 7. So Graham's going to be there obviously and I'm going to go straight from Violet's birthday to work, which is so rubbish I know, but it's what happens when you just don't have enough holiday to take and... I've obviously had this week off, I took off Tuesday. Yep. Where are we? Little what are we watching? The Walking Dead? No, I've gone oh. No Walking Dead. <gasps> yes. Happy Friday, everybody. It's Violet's birthday big party. day today. Violet's birthday party. Where's not the small? And it's so look birthday. at my cake. It's half eight. I've got Violet in the bath. Um, she's just having a soak and I'm doing her hair. Um, I'm actually going to quickly, while she's in the bath, while I was about to play, I'm going to quickly um, mop the floors. I'm so desperate to do it because obviously we've been away and 
Um, yeah, it just needs doing, just, I feel like it needs doing, so I'm going to do that quickly. I've got to put another load washing on, I've put one load in the tum dryer. And um, yeah, and I really want to go out and see the girls, because I haven't seen them pretty much all week. So I will do that, hopefully, before we go off today. Excited for your big day today, Vi? Yeah. Yeah? Just do We've got a special present for Violet. Okay. Let's open it. That's the dress you picked out to wear. <gasps> What's that? Pom pom. She's with pom poms in. Do you like them? Wow. And some hairbands. Wow. A baking t-shirt. What is it? With a it, unicorn on it. It's apron. The apron is... You're going to wear that today? Yeah. Cool. What else? Um, a dress. What do you think? Do you like it? Yeah? I'm to see the girls, it's Fan, as you can tell. He's my beau. I haven't seen you for ages, have I? I haven't seen you since Sunday. Wow, Monday morning, I suppose. Look at them, they're filth. What are you even doing? Fan! Hello. She just is so greedy. So greedy. So peaceful. Just switch off for half an hour while I'm here. Turkey's going. Come on, Fan. Come have a cuddle. I'm trying to get Fan to like me more. Well, she doesn't like me. She's just wary because she knows Bo is obviously with me when she was first here with me. She just needs to get used to me. Take my camera. Fan, look at that face. He's so beautiful. Oh. Hey, you've got to be buddies, haven't you, remember? She's like, butting me, saying, don't do it. <clears throat> hey, ah, 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 ah. See, you see it? Caught it on camera. Hey. Sassy little thing. Sassy, that's what her name should be, Sassy, not Bo, Sassy. <laughs> I call her that most of the time. Anyway. Hey. Hey! Oh yeah! Face over for the face. Alice is off on an adventure. Where are you going, darling? <clears throat> You're not telling me. <laughs> right, birthday day. I've got my top on that I got from Penny's yesterday. I'm like, girl. You're the birthday girl, are you? Yeah, it's like pink, blush pink. It's quite pretty actually. Oh, Five match. euro, absolute bargain. Match. Right, match. Too cute. So see you there. I think I need that postcode as well. <laughs> oh, you not got one? Uh, no, that was the last one. Oh, you got it. Um, yeah, so we've got party bags, party bags, and then we've also got stickers, which say, thank you for coming to my party, love Violet, and it's a little girl. I got those from eBay, I think they're about two pounds. We've arrived, you see it? It says, welcome yeah. to Violet's birthday baking party. Lucky girl, look at this. Goodness. Today has been so good. It's about five past two. <gasps> no way. Hello. Wow, aren't you lucky? Hello. Wow. Right. Oh, yay. 
Unicorn Diary. Back home with loads of cake to eat the next couple of days. And all the girls made their own muffins to take home. Blueberry muffins. Yeah, it all turned out amazingly. Like literally, the lady just took over. There was the two ladies and I think it might have been one of their daughters. She might have been about teenager age. And yeah, then you just go into their sort of basement area and they've got all the tables set up with everything and they just do it all with them. Um, yeah, then they sort out putting stuff in the oven, they make the pizza, they have it for lunch. They did like about three games, I think, with prizes as well. They did hide and seek around the house. The, the house is a beautiful farmhouse. And yeah, they put on coffee, teas, shortbread, scones for the, for the parents so it was just like amazing it was just so relaxing and I was just like catching up with my friends the kids were just playing and just you know baking and doing their own thing um it was so good it finished a little bit earlier as well which is we were there a little bit earlier so it finished a little bit earlier which was kind of good because the kids were kind of getting to the point where they were they were you know just losing their concentration and getting a bit tired so um yeah I managed to get home to the point where I didn't have to go straight to work so that's what I was kind of worrying about so I did take my work stuff with me but um yeah it's only quarter past two now so I'm gonna sort myself out get ready for work I don't want to go I don't want to go just because I just want to stay and it's such a nice day as well the party was a complete hit wasn't it it was a complete hit with the parents yeah. especially they were just like this is amazing time for work close sorted right you going you taking the kids back to work Gray? Taking the kids back to work. Yeah. Violet's got all her prezzies. Aren't you a lucky girl? Oh. Home from work. Oh, look at my washing that yeah, I've got sort out. Oh, at least it's dry though. It's just it's ironing, sauce. putting it away. Yeah. Here with the family. Oh, Graham has been working with the kids, haven't you? You've been out yeah. busy? Huh? Mm -hmm. It is about ten, actually 10 past 10. I'm still uploading my weekly vlog. Um, yeah, we just actually watched Gunpowder. That new series is out with Kit Harrington. I'm not too sure about it. It was quite gruesome the first episode. I was a bit like, whoa, that's a bit insane. But um, yeah, I'm kind of a bit. Might have to watch another episode. I've got washing to put away. I've just got the kiddies' um, Halloween bits out. Purely because we've been very much into Violet's mode of the week, and it's still half term. It's still Alistair's week as well, and. Um, Halloween's on Tuesday obviously and it's just we're just dragging it out and the kids have got an inset day on the Monday so yeah I'm dragging it out over the weekend and just enjoy a bit of Halloween themed stuff because I haven't even got my Halloween box out yet can you believe it um, anyway I really hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog um, I'll leave all links to the places we went to and stuff like that because I know I will get asked about it so I'll leave it linked in the description and I will see you all soon